tonight we have an inside look at a new kind of policing that's underway right here in central Indiana. Yeah, over the last year there have been growing calls across our country for police reform and tonight more local police departments are hiring but not just officers. Destin Grove shows us who else is hitting the streets to serve and also protect. When dispatchers send police to the scene for help, in Bloomington, it's not necessarily just officers who respond anymore. So do Melissa Stone and Lysandra McCoy. I think that's a good start, especially when, when really gets They're going. social workers hired by Bloomington police. And what I find is that people are just kind of falling through the cracks. They respond with officers, or sometimes right after, to help those struggling with mental illness, homelessness, addiction, or domestic disputes. You name it, if they call the police department, I can work with them to try to find them services so they don't need to call the police anymore. That's the goal. Chief Mike Dekoff says he began looking at social workers in 2019 to help cut down on repeat callers to 911. And two years later, those have dropped to um, almost nothing with a lot of those people. So successful, he says, the department added Lysandra two months ago and is about to bring on a third person soon. I think they're very critical today, and I think the need for them is, is only going to grow. And Bloomington police say they've heard from other communities looking to make changes, especially over the last year, amid growing calls nationwide for police reform. You know, you can you can look at the calls for reform across the country and they're like the police shouldn't be responding to certain things, but nobody else is. That is, he says, until now. Police in West Lafayette just hired a social worker who spent time training here in Bloomington, learning from Melissa Stone, who says she and her colleagues are making a difference with those in need one day at a time. Just them calling to say, hey, I was able to make make it to my appointment today, so I was able to get medicine. And you know that's changing their their life. No badger patrol car, but a new part of the thin blue line with just as much passion to serve and protect.